how projection works what i mean by projection is how we project our innermost emotions our innermost psyche and our innermost thinking on other people now for example everyone knows that there are so many different parts of our psyche that we ourselves are ashamed of and therefore when we look at maybe a celebrity whose actions depict just a hint of that thing that we are ashamed of in our own psyche we project on that celebrity that this is 100% what this person is doing and also we are the first ones to condemn that action of that celebrity because we want validation from our surroundings and we want validation from ourselves that this is a behavior that i condemn and therefore this is a behavior that i should not be engaging in i would not be engaging in now what i mean to tell you is for example let's say for virat kohli if in that particular situation india was already down and out and there was no way there was very little way in which india could win there could be a lot of people who are projecting that now what virat will do is he'll play selfishly he'll play very slowly just gather 50 60 70 runs for himself so that his own average improves and he will act very selfishly even though india will not win now this is something that if you think that 100% this is what virat kohli was doing then and there understand that it is how you think he is doing it's not what he is doing and therefore your projection of this particular uh, way of action is actually telling you that this is what you think should be done now this is something that a lot of people do not really understand but this is exactly how projection works it happens in our day to day lives also i personally know a lot of people who in their office environment let's say let's consider a simple example this person does not like to be his or her manager's puppet and therefore in an interaction with someone who whose actions appear make him appear as if he is a manager's puppet this person is going to go out of their way to condemn this particular action of being a manager's puppet now what happens in this particular situation why i'm talking about all of that is not because i don't want you to be a manager's puppet of course i don't want you to be but we'll unpack that in a later video what i want you to understand is that your relationships with other people your interactions about other people your interactions about celebrities and about general actions are a mirror of your own thinking are a mirror of your own psyche it's like that quote i forget what the exact quote was but it was something to the tune of you can tell much more about a person about not not by understanding what he does but by understanding what he thinks about other people and that is it because we project our innermost fears our innermost shames on other people especially on celebrities because they're public figures and we can very easily do that and therein lies the life lesson we project our shame and our fears on other people and if you become simply aware of this particular thing in action the utility that you can derive from it will be that you'll be able to better extract the juice from the present situation and that's it that's all i wanted to talk about with regards to this particular thing in this video